Hello, everyone. This is Adam again. Thank you for stopping by the channel today. I hope all you had a chipper and blessed day. Today's episode 23 for the TTM series. Did unfortunately get one return to sender this week, but I did get a healthy stack of 19 returns and 11 points for the end of the year free for all. So we're going to get into this big old stack right now. The first one is a return to sender of Denny Walling. If anybody has a current address for him, please hook me up down in the comments. All right, the first success is going to be a duel sent out from my address and my girlfriend's address. And it's because it's a big boy. It's a heavy hitter. And, of course, I wanted to try to maybe sample what his autograph is because he's uh, pretty infamous as a possibly a, uh, a uh, what's the word I'm looking for, an auto pen or a, maybe a stamp autograph. So I wanted to send out to him because I'm seeing other people get them. But it's a Barry Sanders took 13 days and I sent to him twice of course one from my address and one from my girlfriend's address just to kind of get a, a good sample size y'all let me know what y'all think uh, my personal opinion is I would have to agree with the uh, majority of the people out there it looks pretty uh not hand signed if you would sit there and uh say but you know still you know an all-time great and a chance to try now, this next guy is a basketball player, just recently retired, and uh, I think he's a top 30 player of all time. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you think. Top 30 or not, and it is of the German, Dirk Nowinski. Free of charge, it took 204 days, one-on-one -on -one success, and bam, there's even his address there. If you'd like to sit there and send to it. All right, which car did I get? I got this beautiful... Tops Dallas Mavericks Dirk Nowinski. Bam, that looks good. It's got his jersey number inscription as well. And that looks good to me. It's on the 2007 Tops. Top 30 player all time or not? Let me know. All right, now this next guy is definitely top 30, and a lot of people think he's top 10. Uh, let me know what you think on that regards as well. Some people might even say he's the best center of all time. And I got, once again, I had to sit there and send twice just to get a good sample size. And why not sit there and get two of a legendary player such as Shaq? Took 86 days and 87 days of one-on-one -on -one success. And he's actually free of charge. So uh got a point on it as well. Because one of the cards is from the 90s. That beautiful collector's choice. Bam. And he inscribed his jersey number. And now this, to me, is live ink. You can even kind of sit there and see where the pen left the card a little bit as, it, as it's moving. Some darker and lighten uh, ink or whatnot. So you can sit there and tell that. Uh, and it's just uh, ever so slightly different, but, you know, pretty much, you know, the same autograph as well. So makes me feel like that's more of a legit autograph as well was the Dirk. Let me know down in the comments, though. All right, let's get on to the baseball returns for the day now, though. The first baseball return is going to come from Steve Bruchel, uh, 404 in 75 days, free of charge. And, of course, chasing down my 86 top set. Got him on the 88, 90, 91 tops. Next return is Bill Landrum, uh, one point for the team, free 12, I guess I don't know the date, 303. And I got him on the... 90 Upper Deck, 90 Donruss, and the 91 Tops. Next return is going to be Ed Vandenberg, uh, 16 days, 3 of 3, free of charge. Hang back to that 86 top set. Just check that out. That just looks so beautiful on that car to me. Let me know. 87 Tops, and then the 88 uh, Fleer. Next return is going to be a Pete Harnish, uh, 1 point 25 days free of charge two or two got him on the 90 donors and the 91 tops the next return is going to be of jack howe 58 days free of charge six is six not sure why he wrote his uh email address there maybe that's uh for some kind to uh charity or, or something other if any of y'all know please let me know he didn't give me no literature on it, but I did get him on my 86 top set. Uh, the 88, uh, 90, 90, 
91, and 92. Next return is going to be of J. Bell, Bell, J. Bell, 21 days free of charge, 404. My tongue got tied big time there on me. Please stick around. So I do have a few uh, bangers to close this out. Uh, so you ain't going to want to uh, stop watching the video just yet. I uh, got them on the 88 Donruss, the 88 Fleer, 90 Donruss, and the 91 Tots. The next return is going to be Mr. TTM legend Bobby Witt, 34 days, 4 or 5, free of charge. And I got them on, didn't get them on the score. Did get them on the Fleer, 88, and the 90 Donruss, uh, 90 Upper Deck, and the 91 Tops. Next return is going to be Mr. Ron Kittle, 3 of 3, free of charge, 14 days. And this dude could mash the ball back in the day. It was fun to watch him hit. Uh, got him on the 88 Fleer, the 88 Score, and then the 90 Upper Deck. Next return is going to be a Danny Tartable. Uh, one point two dollar per eighteen days, five or five success, and this is another guy that can match the ball. I love his autograph too. Let me get it over here. Look at it on that big old gold rookie cup, and got his uh, uh his jersey number in there as well on each of these. Uh, for different teams, he had a different jersey number, so you'll sit there and see that as well. But that's a beautiful autograph. I love that uh, Diamond King there as well. Looks good on that. As you can sit there and see a different jersey number from the Mariners to the uh, Kansas City. And then uh, there we go again on the 88 Fleer. Got him on the uh, 90 Donruss. And then the 91 Tops. All righty. The next one is Frank Vi Viola. One-on-one -on -one success. $5 per five days. That's the fastest return I've ever gotten, five days. I mean, he just got there and he pulled it out the mailbox, signed it, and shipped it right back to me on that beautiful 91 Tops All-Star. And, uh, of course, you know, us Braves fans, we don't like him when he played uh, in Minnesota there and, and beat up on us a little bit in, against John Smokes in that epic game in the World Series. But uh, bygones be bygones. All right, this next one has got a, this next guy's got a really cool nickname. Been seeing other people get them. I've been trying to look for the right cards to buy and sit there and send off. I finally found a really cool lot that had uh, basically two sets of duplicates of uh, four different years of his cards. So I went ahead and bought them all. Sent one set for my address and one for my girlfriend's address. But he only signed three of each of them. And wrote that note on the back. And it's uh, Mr. Spaceman, Bill Lee. And both of them came back in 15 days. And he sat there and said, one card to Cuba. And then $5 extra, one card free for each team or whatnot. And, but I sent them all from only the Red Sox team. So I'm not sure what any of that means. Any of y'all know? Please unlike me down in the comments. But I did get them on the uh, 86, 87, and 88 tops times two so i got two sets of duplicates there and all looking good thank you mr spaceman all right this next return is going to be at the louisiana lighting ron gidry free of charge 16 days 101 and uh this one's from my girlfriend's address last mail day or two mail days ago i got them from my address or whatnot and i got them on that beautiful 83 tops so as always let me know what your favorite autograph was and what was your favorite player to watch play. Thank y'all once again for watching my video. Please have a blessed and a chipper day, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye now.